Today, I'm going to show you how to use the multiple choice questions in my Biomania AP Bio exam preparation system to set yourself up to get a four or a five on this year's AP Bio exam. So let's do AP Bio Review. Multiple choice questions. Biomania's multiple choice questions are interactive. When you use Biomania, it's like having your own infinitely patient biology tutor. When you get questions right, you'll get some praise. Way to go. All right. Good job. When you get a question wrong, you'll get a hint and you'll see that question again. Biomania will keep working with you until you figure out the answer. It guides you to mastery by challenging you with the questions you got wrong until you know the material inside and out. The questions are organized into the eight unit AP Bio framework. You can use this menu to have Biomania randomly give you questions from the entire curriculum, which is by far the best way to review. Or you can choose any combination of topics that you want to focus on. Note that you can control the size of the set of questions that you work with at any one time. I recommend that you start with 20 questions. That's because the questions that you get wrong will come back to you and you want to have a chance to answer them again in the same session. To get the most out of using these questions, slow down and take in the feedback that I've provided for each response. Let's say that you're working a question and you get it right. Way to go. Pat yourself on the back and then carefully read the feedback. Make sure that you really understood the answer because this is a multiple choice test and it's possible to get the right answer by guessing. Or maybe you weren't exactly sure, but you had a hunch. It doesn't matter. Reread the question and the answer and make sure that you understand both before continuing on to the next question. Now let's look at another question. Let's say that you get this one wrong. First of all, don't let yourself go into a negative thought spiral. I can't do this. I don't have time for this. Getting a question wrong is a good thing. It's going to help you fill in the gaps. It's going to help you get to that four or five. So slow down, focus, and look carefully at the feedback. I'm not going to give you the answer. Instead, I'm going to give you a hint. In this case, tRNAs are involved in protein synthesis. What are proteins made of and what do tRNAs transfer? That hint might lead you to the answer. Proteins are made of amino acids. tRNAs transfer amino acids to ribosomes. I have a song about this. tRNA's job is to bring amino acids to ribosomes so proteins can be synthesized. Ooh. mRNA, tRNA, and ribosome. So look over the question and say to yourself, this is a tRNA, and the thing that the tRNA carries is an amino acid. Let that new knowledge sink in. Now, if that hint doesn't lead you to the answer, you can still gain a lot from this question. Look at the other choices and think about them. You'll probably be able to figure out that the correct answer isn't the first choice, DNA. That's because DNA, as you know, is a double helix, a long linear molecule. It wouldn't be represented by a sphere. You might remember that the second choice, a vesicle, is a little membrane enclosed capsule that's used to transport things inside cells. In terms of scale, a vesicle would be much larger than a tRNA, which is a molecule. But maybe you weren't thinking of scale and maybe that spherical shape confused you. Just slow down and think it through. Let yourself learn from the feedback. When you see this question again, the worst case scenario is that you'll remember that the answer isn't three nucleotides and you'll give it your best shot from the three other choices. You can do this. You want that four or five. So just make a commitment to reviewing the right way. If you don't make that commitment, you're going to walk out of the test with a lot of regrets because you'll know that you had the opportunity to really learn the biology that you needed to know and you didn't. But if you do put in the time and you get that four or five, you know all the great things that might happen. Your parents are going to be so proud. Your friends are going to admire you. You'll set yourself up to get into the college of your choice. Don't wait. It's best to get started right away so that you're not cramming at the very last minute. Thanks so much. tRNA's job is to bring amino acids to ribosomes so proteins can be synthesized. Ooh. mRNA, tRNA, and ribosomes plus amino acids make a protein, make a machine. Read the code, now make a polypeptide. That translation, cells synthesize proteins. The small subunit of a ribosome binds with an mRNA's leading end and slides until it reaches star code on a U.